Hello, in this video, we will be looking into how to password protect your PDF files using the Google Apps Script. Here, in this folder, I have the two PDF files and which are not password protected. Let me let us see the output first. I have created Google Apps Scripts and by by then this menu has been added uh, and it contains one button add password to all pdf files of local folder and let me click and it, it is running script and looks like it is yeah it is generating the password protected files here we go and this is the output so it says the it has Get the password to sample1.pdf and saved as a sample1 underscore protected and same thing for the sample2 and if I open this file it is asking me for the password and the password is hello12345 and it's opening same thing for sample2 as well hello one two three four five and it is opening and it working great so now let us see how I what is the code looks like so here under the extension and Google Apps Script let me open this Apps Script project and as you see this is the source code here I have I have added the reference the drive so that I can get all the files from the drive and save it back here I have the API key from the PDF post service and this API key is required to perform all the operations with the PDF Go endpoint if you do not have this API key you can go to the pdf.co and sign up and upon sign up you will receive this API key and this is the password I defined hello12345 and let us see the code one by one initially we are getting the reference of the spreadsheet we are getting the ID of the current spreadsheet and then we are getting the parent folder and if your requirement is like that you want to uh, password protect files from some particular folder you can do like this you can get folder by name and go through all the contents and get the get the exact folder name and eventually get the file name all the files from that folder but in this case the requirement is very simple we we, we will get all the all the files from the current folder in which this excel is residing so here i am getting all folder name and this is logic uh, basically this is the event whenever this excel is opening it will add the menu name the pdf code and the sub menu with the with this name add password to all pdf files of current folder and upon clicking of this it will perform this function execution let us see what this function contains here we are getting all the files of the current folder and we are iterating through uh, each files and making it password protected if you see the logic of this get pdf files from current folder what it is doing uh, basically it is iterating for all the files and checking whether the file is pdf and make sure it's not protected uh, this is the very simple logic but you can always enhance it and here here essentially what we are doing we are uploading this file to the pdf co cloud so that it can be further processed uh, by default these all files are protected hence it cannot be accessed by any third party and and we want to password protect with the use of the pdf co so pdf Oh, does require the permission of the file or the or the public URL of the file but in this case I do not want it to make it public so I upload to the PDF cloud which hold the file for temporary period of time uh, 
and uh, and after that I'm just return, returning this uh, PDF URL back and if we see this function basically it is uploading to the PDF Code cloud uh, it is creating the pre-signed URL and uploading the files to that generate pre-signed URL here it is and once that is completed let us see the main code here here we are adding the password to the PDF file since we have the public URL uh, from the PDF code server and creating the payload here uh, it contains all the parameter like the URL, owner password, user password, uh, encrypts algorithm and then set of options like the whether we want to allow print or allow filling the form or, or the print quality and once that's configured we are just invoking this endpoint with these options and it will return us the URL and then we are uploading the generated file here and yeah that's it so that's how easy you can password protect your pdf files using pdf co and google apps script in the description i will list out the link to the github url so that you can uh, play with the source code